sign behind you? That is for the Milwaukee Arena, otherwise known as the Mecca Arena, now known as the UW-Milwaukee Panther Arena. But this is the arena where I grew up going to Bucks games and Marquette games. And tonight, your first time inside. My first time inside. We are here to watch the Milwaukee Admirals face off against the Chicago Wolves. It's a huge rivalry, and apparently the players don't like each other too much. So, um, I'm excited to get in and go Admirals. First thing you'll notice is that they immediately give you some sort of a promotional item, calendars this year for tonight's game. And this is going to be a very packed game yeah. with the Chicago Wolves in town. Could be close to a sellout, much higher than their typical crowds we should expect. Yeah. Now the crowds are nowhere near what you'd expect in an NHL game, but we will have a bigger crowd than normal tonight for the Admirals. This arena seats about 10,000 people for hockey. You're probably going to get about six or 7,000 tonight at least for, for this game. Please welcome the United Steelworkers Patrick Fungal's kids tonight from Albrook, Utah. And now, led by co Pender number one, Pro Of course, the wolf yeah. score first. We have 54 seconds left in the first period. There are three periods. So, and how long are the periods each? 20 minutes. There we go. Tie game of one. Time for the power play. to Pfizer 4. How much smaller are these concourses? Uh, pretty small compared to Pfizer. This is cool. This is how they keep control of everything from the arena temperature to so many other aspects of the arena, both air conditioning and heating. They actually show you how it gets done. All right, Bob. Go ahead. <laughs> Boom. People have walked these hallways in this arena for almost 70 years. This place was built in 1951. The Milwaukee Hawks of the NBA were first here about a decade and a half before uh, the Bucks showed up. And then came Marquette. They started playing their games here. They were here until about the mid 80s when they went across the street to the Bradley Center. Now they play in. Forum. Arguably the best arena in the world, but this place still has a lot of charm to it. So of course while we're waiting for 
these extreme nachos to come. The Admiral score goal number two tonight. Hello once again and welcome to Anthony again. We are here at Admirals and the Wolves playing one more game of 17. The Admirals have won two of the last three games they have played. The Admirals have the pop. They're taking it down, taking it down. Oh, what a pass by one guy to the other. Oh, let's go Admirals. Oh, the Wolves just got it back. There they go. Oh, the Wolves. Oh, and it is not a goal. They got Got a break away and took it in for goal number three. Woo! Three one! Let's go, Ads! I'm having so much fun at this game. It feels like an indoor baseball game almost because of the crowd and um, I love how it's just so intense, which is really fun to watch. And it, it's like Friday night hockey. It's really fun. Someone wants overtime. I want be here as long as possible. <laughs> well, the, the Milwaukee owning a 3-1 lead, that's odds are kind of against that, but we'll see. And of course, whether you're at a sporting event, a concert, or meeting the Queen of England, this little guy's got to get Jack and Tenders. Tenants tonight was a little more than 8,000 people. $26,000 raised. game you can remember what do you think four to one win for the admirals they are how many points uh they're in a big lead in their division but yeah. what did you think of the hockey game experience as a fan amazing i love uh, this um atmosphere for and the admirals fans were funny they were fun they were loud and i really liked it this is almost a 70-year-old arena. What did you think of uh, what's now called Panther Arena, but the old Mecca? How old? Almost 70 years old. Wow. Okay. For a 70-year-old arena, it is, is really good. You can, it looks like it was built 30 years ago. And I think it's just the right size for minor league hockey for the yeah. AHL. Perfect setting for a game like this. And it's where I grew up going to Bucks games, Marquette games. I'm glad they still use it and use it for some good, good stuff. We will take our next My City Milwaukee journey sometime. Yeah, <laughs> probably uh, next week. Perhaps, we'll, we'll find out. So what do you do to keep uh, abreast of what we're doing? Subscribe, um, hit the bell, like, share, subscribe, and hit the bell again. Um, and we are almost to 100 subscribers. If by the time we already are 200 subscribers by the time this is posted, thank you. Um, we appreciate it. <laughs> but more importantly, enjoy the time with the people you love. Don't just 
Yeah, we love that you watch our videos, but don't just sit home and watch videos. Go out there, enjoy each yeah. other. Have fun with your family, your friends, the people you love. Experience life like we do. So long, everybody. So long. Blue Maria. The dying wolf.